Hello and welcome to the third day of competition here in Sofia. It is um, the World Sambo Championship and uh, we will start very quickly with uh, women under 56 kilograms. We have um, in red Anastasia Valova from Russia and her opponent in blue from uh, Ukraine, Natalia Ilkiv. So, uh, this is the first weight class and uh, it's the most interesting because uh, there are a lot of, lot of good fighters in this weight class and uh, the qualifications were very difficult for uh, both these young ladies and uh, for sure we're going to see a lot of interesting things. In red, the Russian, in blue, the Ukrainian. The fight starts very quickly with uh, Valova trying to, uh, to secure a single leg. Good defense for the Ukrainian. Still nothing happens on the ground then the referee will stand him up and he does very quickly. They restart with, uh, with the same attitude. I'm very curious how much can uh, Anastasia Valova see right now. She had that um, she has that, um, that bandage over her head and uh, that bandage covering one of her eyes good very good defense for uh, uh, for Ilkiv it is um, it is a very interesting problem I mean, know very well the fact that uh, in grappling uh, in general and uh, so in samba also it's very important to to feel your opponent you don't need to uh, to see very much but it's very difficult when you have um, that type of uh, bandage over your um, eye and over your um, your head Valova tried to uh, uh, to go for a combination she started with uh, an arm block and then uh, followed the combination with uh, an attempt if an attempt of a knee bar this is a classical combination, that, but it didn't work for, uh, for Valova. She has now uh, a good grip on the leg. Nothing. Nothing, because uh, it gives the city to, uh, to turn her belly towards the floor. And so nothing happened. They restart right now. Only one point for uh, the Russian. Ilkiv needs to uh, to be a little bit uh, more aggressive right now. She needs to um, to look more for the techniques, not to wait so much. Valova still the aggressor. She has the she has the ankle. Let's see whether she can uh, finish that uh, uh, that ankle lock. She changes to the other leg, but uh, uh, they are still on the ground. They are still looking for uh, for the techniques. Valova has the leg, but uh, I don't think she will be able to um, to finish the attack. Good, very good position for Valova, but it's not, it's not deep enough and we can see this. Yeah, it stood up. It was a very good effort for, uh, for Valova, but, uh, but not enough. The technique was just not deep enough, so it's very difficult to, uh, to finish a technique when uh, you don't have uh, the correct position. But of course... The correct position and the perfect position uh, is something that uh, a fighter can only wish for. On the mat everything changes and you have to, uh, to change with the flow. Some problems with um, Ilkiv's hair. Have a few moments. And now uh, we restart the competition. Uh, Valova is very confident. Looking for uh, for an inside trip. The same thing from Ilkiv. And Valova looking for a single leg. 
nothing happens. Uh, the, the Russian is very aggressive right now, and we can see that. She ha she leads by two points, but uh, she really is aggressive. Again, she is looking for uh, for a good technique, but loses the position. Ilkiv is. Uh, is attacking but uh, she is not very disciplined in um, in her attacks she needs to um, uh, to change a little bit uh, her approach she needs to uh, to control the pace of the fight and uh, not to react on Valova's uh, attacks And again, looking for the throw is um, is Ilkiv, but nothing happens. A good lapel grip for uh, a good lapel grip for um, the Ukrainian, but she loses the grip. And step by step, we see Valova's uh, bandage almost falling. She, but she's still, um, but she's still in advantage right now. I don't think she really cares about that uh, that uh, little uh, malfunction. And Valova with the single leg. The last um, seconds of the fight, and Valova trying again to uh, to go for a nice technique, and she still attacks. Again the single leg, again the sweep, and uh, she almost got that uh, that ankle lock. The last second of the fight, and uh, I really think uh, Valova is the winner. I mean, it's impossible to deny this. So, the first gold medal of uh, of today's uh, competition goes to Russia, to Anastasia Valova. Uh, a very very nice final